On today's Star of the Week, we'll be taking a look at Omoni Oboli and her journey through stardom. Omoni Oboli is a Nigerian actress, scriptwriter, film director, producer and digital filmmaker born on the 22nd of April 1978. Mrs. Phillips, tell me, how does it feel to be the first female PPM gubernatorial candidate? Oboli was born in Benin City, Edo State in the south southern region of Nigeria. She is a descendant of Mosogar, a small village in Delta State. We go continue, Amo. Yes. We go, they come here every day yes. until they answer us. Yes. Omoni Oboli completed both her primary and secondary school education in Benin City, Edo State. After completing her secondary school education, Omoni Oboli proceeded to the University of Benin, Nigeria and graduated with a bachelor's degree in French with a second class upper division. Following the completion of her first degree, Omoni Oboli went abroad for further studies at the New York Film Academy where she studied digital editing in a four-week workshop. Omoni began her movie career with her first movie role in Bitter Encounter in 1996 where she played a secretary. She then went on to play the lead female character in three major movies titled Not My Will, Destined to Die and Another Campus Tale. She is also the first actress from Nollywood to win Best Actress in two international festivals that are not organized by Nigerians or Africans in the year 2010. This she did at the Harlem International Film Festival and the Los Angeles Movie Awards for her lead role in the movie Anchor Babe. Every time I have a movie come out in the cinema, what I do is a cinema tour. So I go from cinema to cinema. I literally do not sleep for over two weeks at least, because I'm going from one cinema to the other. Every day I wake up in a new city. You know, I, I could do three, if, if, it's, if a city has three cinemas, I'll do all three cinemas in one day. So we just pick different time slots, and then we go there and we do box office sales, and you know, we get to interact with the audience and take pictures with them. They love stuff like that.